There's some confusion now about new TSA requirements coming soon. On top of your driver's license, you could also need another form of ID or a passport. But this takes effect in January of next year, 2018. So if you're flying in the coming weeks, you will be just fine. News 2's Ashley Yost is at Charleston International Airport now, where she talked to people about the change. Well, soon you could need more than a South Carolina driver's license to get through TSA here at Charleston International, even for a domestic flight. We talked to people today. Some said, sure, it'd be an inconvenience, but if it makes them safer, then they're all for it. Others said they think it's excessive and unnecessary. Congress started the requirements in 2005 after 9-11 to make it harder for people to travel with fakes. Lawmakers are fighting the change for a couple reasons. First, it'll cost around $17 million. Majority, the state's responsibility. Also, some feel the states should be in charge of the regulation, not the federal government. This January is the deadline for local officials to work something out with Homeland Security. If they don't, your driver's license might not cut it with the TSA come 2018. A South Carolina ID issued in 2010 or later is good to go. State leaders expect those who got a license before October 2010 will need to go to the DMV and get a new one. Some say it's worth it. Others think it's excessive. As far as flying and traveling, I probably am okay with the increased security. I think if they think there's an issue and people are getting through, if there's an issue with their, their IDs, then eh, I think it's probably better. I mean, they're pretty thorough about how they're inspecting the IDs up front. I mean, they have other ways to verify whether it's a government identification or not. I don't think you have to waste people's time making them get another set of identification. I don't think anyone's happy to go to the DMV. I think it's something that everyone dreads. South Carolina is not the only state. Some states in the same boat, Oklahoma, Pennsylvania, and Maine. But just again, it's not this year. If you're traveling in the coming weeks, you'll be fine. It's 2018 when you'll need to pack extra documents. At Charleston International, I'm Ashley Yost, News 2.